If you are in a new relationship and it's been a while since the last one, then you might be wondering, is this a healthy relationship? What are the signs of a good relationship? I think I can help you with that. So seven signs of a healthy relationship coming right up. Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Justine Fulama and as always I talk about dating, relationship and being single. If you like that, please make sure that you subscribe to my channel as always because I will post a new video every Wednesday and I want you to know first. I define a healthy relationship as a relationship that is filled with love, joy and trust. A relationship in which both partners feel cherished, respected and safe enough to completely open up to each other. While every relationship is different, there are a few key aspects that will allow you to thrive as a couple. And seven of them are coming right up. Number one, you don't mind apologizing. Relationships are complicated and they need work. No matter how well you get along, there will be times of conflicts. However, what allows a healthy relationship to succeed is that both partners are willing to work on it. If both of you can say sorry and don't hold on to pride, a grudge or resentment, then that is a sign that you're in a healthy relationship. Number two, you are a team. The best thing about having a best friend is that he or she got your back and that's the same thing in a relationship. Both of you are willing to defend the other person in their presence and in their absence. In a group setting, other people can tell that you're union because you respect each other and you communicate to each other in a loving way. Both of you make each other look good and support each other. That's what makes a healthy relationship. Number three, you can be vulnerable. In healthy relationships, both partners want the other person to feel comfortable enough to share their emotions and voice their opinion, even if that means facing criticism and disappointment. You feel safe enough to bring up anything because you know you will be met with receptiveness and support. Healthy relationships are transparent and you feel like you can communicate about anything and talk about anything. One thing that I want to remind you of is that in order for you to be vulnerable, you need to be able to trust the person that you're dating. And I created a free ebook with 50 questions to identify the one that I believe will help you discern in the relationship. So make sure that you grab a copy in the description box below and do the quiz. Number four, you encourage each other. In a healthy relationship, you encourage each other to grow as a person and to pursue your passion and purpose. You want the other person to grow even if that means that they outgrow you. Because love does not envy, but it encourages the other person and wants the best for them. One of the most important things in a Christian relationship is that you have one common or two complementing purposes. That's why it's so important that you enter the relationship with a healthy amount of self-love so that you are able to encourage the other and want the best for them. Number five, you make decisions together. A healthy relationship is a partnership in which you don't have to struggle to be hurt. Instead, both of you discuss important life events together. And when a situation arises and affects your relationship, you make the decisions together as well. Number six, you spend time apart. Being in a strong relationship doesn't mean that you spend all your time together. In fact, it actually means that you can have separate interests and friends. You have a sense of individuality that you keep that gives you fulfillment and purpose outside of your relationship. And you don't have to be afraid that your partner will be resentful or jealous. Number seven, you have fun together. Last but not least, the best relationship advice that I can give you is to have fun together. There will be so many moments that life is hard and pulling you down, but a great relationship partner that you can have fun with will add a whole new layer of mental health and sustain you when you are going through a rough time. Because fun and laughter is a great way to increase the health of a relationship. Here we go. Now you know how to assess whether you are in a healthy relationship or not. But what are the things that you appreciate in a relationship? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, if you like this video, then make sure you give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so they can check out these tips for themselves. And I can wait to see you guys in my next video. Until then, love and light.